Jesse, um, I don't know if you remember this, but the last time you and I spoke with each other was when I used to MC. I was the in-house MC for the Jays. No way. Yeah. Oh, wow, man. A long time ago. Nice, man. Huh? Yeah, yeah. You look fantastic, well, I man. I feel good. I do. And uh, like I said earlier, I had some health issues with getting my, my hips replaced. They feel great now. I'm heading out to New York to play the Old Timers game live this Sunday. So I'll play about an hour and a half with the baseball, have fun with them, too. What's this Old Timers thing, man? They got to remove that. I know. It's, it's okay. They call it that. You can call it legends, but it's fun to I like legends because you are a legend, the Toronto Blue Jays. I mean, how do you feel about being part of an organization that has given back so much to the fans of this city? Um, I mean, two world championships the Blue Jays brought in. Um, what you did on the field, I mean, excited so many kids out there too and inspired them to become players also. It really is. And, and we go all over the country with the Blue Jays Academy, working with the kids, and it's, you know, the Raptors, that's, that's Canada's team. Blue Jays, that's Canada's team, and, and we represent them, and I think we do a good job of doing that. You definitely do. Joe Carter Classic, why do you come back to be part of something like this? Well, I love Joe. It's funny, a lot of people don't know this story, but when Joe came to Toronto, I had already been traded to New York, and he calls me up. We've been good friends for a long time. He said, hey, man, would you be offended if I wore number 29? I said, Joe, I'd be offended if you didn't. And he wore it well. Amazing. Amazing. Yes, look, I know you got a lot going on today. But look, I want to say thank you so much for Appreciate everything it. that you've done. Thanks and like I said, man, I had a great time emceeing with the Jays and watch you play. God bless.